Welcome, welcome everyone. It's been a while since I've made a video. I'm gonna walk you through one of my favorite decks this season. Sure, it's the end of the season, but who cares? I wanna make it. So this deck is basically the trifecta of don't put any units on the board, figure out how to use poisons and use cool hexproof planeswalkers, all right? So we're gonna revolve this mainly around Kaya as the real clincher, she's going to save you with some enchantment issues this season, especially. And we got a Virtue of Persistence. We got two of the other ones. So Virtue of Loyalty, one Shieldred, one, two Apocalypses, one Elish Norn, a Farewell, just in case. Uh, then we got two Urza Assembles of Titans. I would plus this up some more if you had the rares and you really want to make this deck work. Maybe get rid of some of the units. Um, but I do think that Virtue of Persistence can be good and sometimes you run into like Jace decks that are truly no unit and having some of your own helps. Flesh Gorger is a really good example of just straight up awesome units. So then we're going to rock Elspeth. Elspeth. Wanderer. Where's the other Wanderer? Ah, Wandering. Wandering, Wanderer. And then Vraska is your real clincher. If you could take more of one and be Vraska. And I do have Liliana. She's fine. I think if you can do... If you could do like four Vraskas and no Lilianas, that's probably a better balance. But Liliana can be good in a pinch. Biggest weaknesses with this deck is just losing early to like a red deck. But Bilius, Cut Down, uh, Edicts are all going to be really, really helpful to you. Uh, to just kind of help you in the early game. And then after that, you're just building into Planeswalkers that are going to put units on the board. Eliminate, you know, Wanderer is amazing to just eliminate the whole board. So, and then Kaya is just going to siphon life. Steal their enchantments. Draw two cards. The guy is just nuts. And being hexproof is amazing. You can add some more deifications to this as well. And then have one for like each of your other ones. I don't necessarily know that Liliana needs it. Because the discard doesn't really synergize great with your deck. But getting it for... Uh, you can't do it for the Emperor because she's not a named Planeswalker. Note that she's just legendary Planeswalker. Which is stupid. Um, but you can get it for Elspeth. And you can get it for... Vraska. And Vraska is especially helpful. Let's jump in, show you a couple games. All right, we're going to find a match. Standard play. I have played with it a bit on ranked, and a few thoughts on that. One, it is a little tougher. You can do it, you can get wins. It's probably a little under 50% in platinum, but it'll definitely get you through gold. Um, it's just slower on rank because there's a few more counters, especially in platinum against the deck. It just makes it, the game go really long. It isn't necessarily bad, but it's, it's rough. And I'm still going to be doing some push ups, finishing out my workout stream again. If you don't know about that, every Saturday morning around 9 o'clock Eastern Time, hop on, do a workout stream. And today I finished up a nice little draft inside the pick on this side. Here we are. Triple Edicts, not a bad way to start the game. Wish I would have drawn a white mana, but holy crap. All right, well, we're gonna ruin some people's days. Okay, you tell me you didn't get anything you wanted. I just hope they don't, they don't actually have that many units and get a little bit stuck. Yavi Maya Coast, interesting. Has to take damage in order to use that. So. Flames blind, he's not using it. Roberto sounds like male, but maybe I should practice my they thems on the, on the online spheres. Unless I know they're genuine. Go for they them, you know? I suck at that. Just be honest. Okay. I hear you. Get it out. We get Shielded Apocalypse. The death, the getting pinged by those just really is fairly irrelevant. 
Counterspell decks can suck with this, by the way. We'll get it at turn end. Oh, bye bye! Oh, bye bye! Nice thing about edicts, by the way, is that they're just a pure sacrifice. So if somebody drops a hex proof or the only thing that saves them is phasing out. And Carpuzlin. This sucks. This is a weird game. It just sucks to keep missing all my mana and then like not be able to drain his cards by dropping edicts. But we're still up net one card. It's just the mana that's giving me big time anxiety. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to start discarding and that's... That suck. But getting cut down is just a, a better use on some of these like questing druids, right? <laughs> Take the win! All right, I'm gonna go pump out my push-ups. I gotta do 20 normals, so that should go pretty fast. Woo! Tune in. We'll get the camera back up this week. Banana sandwiches. Go. Oh. Then we're gonna be grinding out as many fingertip push-ups as I can get in a go. We're not gonna super strain those. This is my favorite, but this is good combos for it. Like I have four cards that I can play. I'm getting just one poison on. Allows you to use the Vraska Proliferate to just kind of ping it up. Get it up there. We're gonna go Persistence. Yeah, Persistent gives you two life, too. Such a good card. Okay, bring it back. We'll cut it down. I wish I had one of those. Oh, man, this sucks. Two poison. Missing these mana is going to kill me, though. No, you want Kami of Transients back. You no, know it's all you've ever dreamed of. Nice thing is, uh, if he does, if they do, you know, now, versus this is actually a creature, if they do, um, then we can cut it down. And they discarded one. Ooh, brutal. There are no flash enchantments, really. There are a couple, but they probably aren't carrying them. Uh, that's two commies down. The two commies are down. All right, we're gonna go for black so we can use a Liliana. Um, and then we'll save Virtue. 
don't necessarily want to like sacrifice it. So we'll figure this out. Good move with restoration. I like that. Love to get another mana to play Apocalypse. Let's see if we can use up another Ossify on it. We'll kill. There we go, perfect. I would way rather it be. Oh, he gets a dragon. That sucks. Enough with the mysteries. I've come. Sacrifices must I've be made. For answers. Ah, oh, I forget that you get it back. That's why that card is so good. Dang it. Let's discard. Be outsmarting me. Titans. He just gets it back from graveyard. I think we give up on this one. I think this is kind of a toast to deal at this point. I just can't compete with this mana. Yeah, and he's just, yeah, we're done. This was I I couldn't pull that out. Just bad mana draws, there's nothing you can do about that sometimes. Even if you get four in hand at the beginning, you could just miss them all. You could do like ambitious farm hands. That would actually probably fit in here okay. But it's just kind of... Just the odds are that that won't happen to you. So it's tough for me to give a recommendation either way. We're going to see how many figure tips I can do while it's loaded. We'll do 15 of something. See, like, these are good. This is not. I really should cycle them out, but having a nice set of options is really helpful. Especially with Planeswalkers, because you don't want to draw all the same ones. And that's why there's only two of each, by the way. So far, so good. But yeah, really in the beginning, if you can get a like, hand pure mana, that's fine. This game, it just scales so well late game. That's easy to get in the other way. Sucks to not be able to play her. If I need her on clutch. Um. This thing is, it's a sacrifice, so it was actually pretty easy. I'm gonna get Archangels next time, so. Those who get in my way tend Soldiers don't have a haste, so. But even if Liliana dies, it's not the worst I've always hated at all. So, I, I like, if they were to gun for her, I'd be happy. Because I don't necessarily even want to discard anything. Let's see what we can get here. Let's do this. Let's see if I can get Braska, sweet. Yeah, I have all of these ones. But if I had to take a double, it'd probably be Wanderer. Um, I kind of want the mana. Well, let's see if we can get Braska. I have five right now, so I really only need six. So let's put Basilica back. I get Wanderer down for free next time, by the way. Uh, 
Now here's the question. Do I want to discard her and force a discard? And I think the answer is yes. I'm tired of your secrets. They used to have like renew and recover or whatever. It gives you one back. But here what I'll do is I'll do wanderer, double strike samurai, and then turn it into an angel. Okay, I have five mana, so we're still okay with that. It does cost six still, so it should be all right. Worst case scenario, we'll do Elspeth Resplendent. Turn the soldier into a flyer. I will 100% do Liliana to kill one of those two, though. I don't even... Don't question me. So, that was a time. It's like, fine. I would have rather used her for something else, leave. but... <laughs> I have to have a way to deal with Thalia. I don't know what that is yet. Okay. Yes. One. I think this will be a good one. Have faith in my soul. Let's do this. Your eyes sharp. Have courage. She kills Archangel. Oh, that sucks. Ah, why? What the hell? What is this? Oh, I want that card. Don't fear monsters. She can only get hit by one now, if that makes sense. I will return as many times as necessary. Here's the question. Let's what clean do we up do this here? Town. Let's see what we get. Safe now. Liliana gets. That's, that's Something suspicious is going on, and for once, it's not my. <gasps> Sacrifices must be made. Do not want to discard. So I'm not going to do that. What I will do. You're coming with me. That. I brought backup. Let's do this together. Give it. I think. Dahlia comes back. We get the mana. We wipe her off. We just need the mana. That's the only thing we need. It doesn't get ward. I have to sacrifice three life. But I'll still just put them in the trash. They let it go tonight. Which would be the smart move in some ways. But we'll see what they have. doesn't attack, then we just do Vigilance. Dahlia comes back with no counters, by the way. Ugh. Vigilance clears that one, then we just take another one, then it can kill Brutal. Well, graveyards would be good. I think. Winter chicken dinner. Yeah, I probably would have done this Urza symbols of Titans there. So we were doing all right. Um, but for sure, we're just exiled the other one, given the 
Double Strike Samurai Vigilance. Taking some health back. Force his hand on, on uh, Thalia. Done it. Let's see if we can pump out 15. 15 normals to round out this day. Five normals and ten bites. Fifth hand. Duck, but is awesome all at the same time. If I didn't have Edict, I would have thrown it, but... It's like worse to miss Edict. Wow. That was awesome. Seed core in here. The Frexian one helps us shield rid and watch the other set. I love getting rid of Harbin. Freaking hate Harbin. Great. Oh. A couple other arenas would be good for this deck too. Just to get the cards. You're gonna get life. Especially Arena with Shieldred Apocalypse. Okay. All right, well that sucks. Um, she's not Prexian, so. We actually have some problems here if we can't draw something useful. Sky Strike is good though. I always like Sky Strike. You can't get it with a cut down, so. Okay. Alright, well, not my favorite, but. Now we have enough to at least get Shieldred down. I we'll have enough for farewell. But it won't matter. We're too late. I mean, if you get Elish and then Shieldred, then she kills too, but... It sucks. Yeah, we were just one man away. All right, time to move into my cooldown phase. Oh, yeah, we're gonna hit a solid 600 calories. And we work out. Oh. 
Yank over the mic. Stretch out my calves while we go. One more. We can get a wide off of Obscura, we get Flesh Forger, this is for you. Probably should have done Billiards first, so that was a little bit of a mistake on my part. It's like the only place I can. My desk is empty underneath, so I can like, stretch it out down. down a little bit. Get it? Kind of close on that one, huh? percent give this I would have used this for man. I the filer works good though. soon and then it's just like gaining life taking life see what defiler does here the back is great Just get some units. We fight together. Nice thing here is that like he gets life back if he does this. Um and pilot or bigger is just so good. Is it just any car? He's just drawn like a madman. I'm just sucking his life force out. Come on, baby. You know you want to do it. 
My thing is if I can activate Shieldred, he's only at two, so I gotta figure that out. But if I could activate Shieldred, then I can target one to kill. Come on, man. Can't kill any of them. Hmm. Where my mana? Her ultimate isn't that great for me. Going to trash, I guess. Keep drawing, buddy. Don't stop. I mean, he gets four life back on Silverback if he plays creatures, I guess. Dude, this is great. Oh, yeah. Not great for me. One more mana, two more mana, and farewell. Man, not looking good for me. Come on! What is with mana? We just need enough units built up that, like, we have units. You will sign Bryce, hero. You can net up life here, though. Nebraska, I can kill a unit. I, I can still up the main sky. Piranha Strikes got this problem. This is rough. Do it. All right, cool. I might have enough damage here that it doesn't matter. As to blockers. Okay, let's go. Solid kill on Silverback. Um. He's just gonna get through regardless. Stop. 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 Kill. Stop. Pray we get this one. Okay, how much is he passing through here? That's what we need to check. He passes through six. Eight, fourteen. I get three back. So this is okay. It's not the best, but it's okay. Go for it, but Thanks for showing up. This crocodile. It's a weird choice, but I like it. I offer you another chance for victory. Uh, he still has Tyrannus, but if I kill Tyrannus here, he has no more. Arduinos. So let's trade Phyrexian on the Topiary. 14, 18. I think he still gets enough damage in. That doesn't That sucks. But what are you gonna do? That's a 
this was our best choice. I would have had like a unit to block with her that would have given me one health back, so just kind of sucked. Anyway, this is one of my more favorite decks if you can draw your mana, but apparently sometimes you just can't. So maybe take some of those ambitious farm hands, maybe an Ijango. Up to you, but um, sometimes it can just be rough. Until next time, good luck out there. Have some fun. Keep on gaming.